Hello, and welcome back to Escape from Mars and Space Engineers. And in this and probably the next few, I'm not sure exactly how many, but at least for now, for the time being, I'm going to see if I can focus everything towards building this which I have started, but I haven't finished. And um, what I want to try to do is get as close to where I will be able to put on and have, a, have them to be in the correct position. Uh, have the whole craft ready so I can start putting on the hydrogen thrusters, which are in that hole over there, which you might or might not see, but this hole. In there, there is a ship with a lot of hydrogen thrusters, so we are going to move them out and put them onto this, but this is not ready yet. So, uh, one thing that I do know I want to do is sort of try to have an interior and I think the easiest way to sort of know if I have enough space is by trying to add a medical room and I'm wondering how I can do that easily Maybe put it, say, down here, or maybe one up, and have sort of a medical bay, and then that snakes up to something, and then on the top we have... Uh, but, uh, 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 the control room where I have my control seat where I can actually fly fly from um hmm. now what I'm going to do with um the seat is that it is going to be down like this this way I will have the easiest way to orient this and go upwards and downwards and forward and backwards and stuff like that um, it's going to be a lot better especially when we get out into space so let's remove that. Um, I think this this is conveyor oh to a two generator. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I think putting this sort of 
like that. <clears throat> Probably want to have it up one level. Can I get a straight pipe? I don't think I can. I might be able to get it if I do this one. A solid straight. Nope. Nope. I need to use this. Which kind of sucks. Um... Hmm. Okay, and then that is going to be a nightmare to get this airtight, which I'm going to try to do. And then What I will do is <clears throat> No, I think I think we need No, we don't actually need that. Um what I do need to do is get the up one level, get like that, and have it in that one there, and then bring this up enough. There's a some sort of reason for my madness here and it's going to be uh, if I have it on my hotbar I don't think I do and um, put that one like that and then the floor should should be able to place it with just light armor blocks and then I need <clears throat> oh and then I need to figure out how I move up in how I sort of go up in this place um hmm i think what i should start doing is a lot of the really important stuff and things that will be buried and become inaccessible i should start welding it up might make it a bit easier to see as well what's what um let's remove you guys just and that needs to oh and uh I have a situation where I can't actually get to something. That's a conveyor junction. And I'm going to have to do the same thing over here. Same thing. Same thing. Remove. And that should allow us to... But technically speaking, I actually don't need to do it on this side. Uh, 
Let's add all of them. Go and get all the stuff we need for it. Build them up and that should... I, I, I do need to make the core in the middle here basically. Because I'm not going to be... I, I'm not going to be able to get to it otherwise. There we go. The O2 H2 generator. Let's leave them for now. Energy low. Yeah, yeah. And that one. Make sure all the conveyors and the vent let's go and get a suit satisfied with some energy oh my god it's dark probably want some light underneath there but eh probably should though not for my sake, it's for anyone watching. There we go. So. <laughs> See if we can get the medical room built. Should make it a bit easier to see how we can make a staircase. I think a staircase will be the best option. I could make sort of a jack jetpack elevator shoot but yeah at that point you have to use jetpack just to get up and down which is a bit annoying and tedious or rather just take the stairs So we have now a ground floor. Let's go and get some more steel plate and stuff. Stuff and things. Apparently I have More scrap and motors on me. A uh, hundred of you, and a hundred of you, a hundred of you, and the rest in steel plates. Um, okay, let's um, not become unable to fly because we didn't think about how much hydrogen we had left uh, let's add some lights in here Uh, 
and that's the one I want. Can barely see it. There we go. Five. Put one there as well. And let's go in here and search light. Interior. Increase the radius to say five. Make the intensity not as glaring. And do this on 230, so we're getting a bit of a jello tint, which doesn't make it as aggressive. Let's see if we can add some more. Don't need that much, it just need needs a bit. a few of them but it will help to actually see stuff um was that all of you i think that was all of them let's go in and set those as well oh i i missed one i missed one Why did I put that? There, there. There we go. Ah, uh, let's see. Five, yes. Intensity three, yes. And all of can be what it is, and then 230. Maybe I should have it at 200. Nah, a bit too much yellow in it. 220 then. Yeah, I think that's better. There we go now we can actually see a bit no, not not a whole lot but a bit um and i did refill my bottles good okay just making sure so i don't forget because that could easily happen. Okay, so that's the ground floor. I could possibly extend it one more. Ish, and then have, say, in the corner here. Uh, not. Please don't change colors. I have it like that. Maybe. 
I'm not sure. We'll see. This is at least the minimum minimum amount of ground space like indoor space we are going to have and the question now is hmm maybe I should have yeah yeah I think uh, let's change you back to full blocks and what I will do is change you two to come around on the other side. See, that's going to be way better. And that's going to make it a lot easier to connect the staircase up. This side is something you can use, whereas this is not. So that should allow me to, if I have it on my hotbar, which I don't, stare. So. And with these, we can put them like, like so, this way. And what I could do then is, have don't I have those at least I'm thinking about a different save okay um let's take you and you don't really care about the railing because you're not going to be that necessary uh seven let's see where is that one right and there needs to be some kind of connection point which i don't have for the time being uh six Should I do a full stair or a half stair? Hmm, that's a good question. Probably a full stair. Probably going to make it easier. I say probably because... Can't really be sure until you test it. Uh, where do we have neon neon tubes down is probably the best way to connect this like that and then have this one connected like that making our way up to the next level which I think could be just here as is and then I'm going to remove you two yeah just have a have it here might be a good idea make it a bit more industrial I think or should I try to move it up one level could do that hmm Mm -hmm. This is the tricky bit. Trying to force an interior in something like this.
I can't place you here because there's no connection point on any spot that is places we can build on. Uh, I can put you here. The thing is, I do want... I really do want to use... be able to put stuff in here. Even if it's not a lot, I do want to be able to have, say, like, a chair or something which you can walk past or sit down in it, sit in, so. Mm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, I. Hmm. I think. Gaining one more level might be required for this to work. And that means... Maybe, maybe not. But... Maybe I need more space. Like, I need one more... Block. To be able to... To have it... Like this. Um... Making making it a bit bigger than I probably want to. But it won't make it too big. But it will make it a lot easier to put stuff in here. Oh, I didn't make it uniform. It's not square. Yeah, that's... But that's one too many. And it, it, it's a bit off-center, but... Uh, yeah, that's two, 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 two. Okay, good. It's square. Um, so, yeah... I think I need to do this and then sort of up on this level where this is we will have the control room and then we will have spots for the absolute last um, hydrogen thrusters the forward facing ones which I'm not sure how I'm going to fit in but but yeah, I think this might be the easiest way to get. Get a interior that actually have some kind of value, usability, which, um, yeah, we are also going to need some sort of way of getting in to this. Might put that on this level, actually. That might be a good idea. And have it go over here where the staircase is. Well, we can't really put a lot of stuff anyway. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. That's probably the sound to end the episode, which we are going to do once I have placed energy low. 
these and tested that they don't block my way up and down. Nope. The half blocks doesn't stop me from going up and down, which is super good. Um, and that means if we see if I have... Of course I don't. A uh, door. Sliding door. That's the best way of getting a, a very easy airlock. Do that. And that means we have a decent amount of space to do whatever we want with and what I could do is to have six uh, is to have the staircase to the next level sort of head directly here and then have sort of a path to go around so you can actually squeeze through and get into a bit of an open air, op more open area and into the airlock. I think that's actually a good idea. But we are going to have to do something about this. But that is going to have to sort of wait. Where is my row? There it is. With how large it is? Is I, I should know where it is at all times, but oh, another distance and it's going to be small anyway, so. But yeah, we have. I picked up. Spectator, um, we have started building up an interior which is going to make it a lot easier when we're going. It's going to make this a bit slower to get done, but I think it's going to be more interesting and uh, more hilarious if it fails, because it will be more rocket to fail with. Uh, and... Uh, yeah, so we are going to continue this and a lot of the focus is going to be to actually get this done. Uh, and once it is done and all the hydrogen thrusters are merged blocked on, what I'm going to do is go and take a look at a ground base and uh, the G Corp headquarters and that's it. So those two bases I'm going to take a look at um, and see if I can survive with uh, my SAF, my fighter. And then, regardless if I succeed or fail, we will blast off in glorious victory and uh, escape Mars. So, for now, I think the all I will say is that you like and subscribe. It would be super awesome and nice if you did. And with that, thanks for watching. Goodbye. And I hope I'll see you in the next one.